Hey everyone, we're here today to install the uh, Kimball's Pinballs LED back box kit. And basically what it does on The Walking Dead here is that if you see like the zombie's eyes or the Walking Dead logo, the colors constantly change on the, uh, on the back glass. It looks really cool. I just did a video at my buddy's house for Kiss. We installed it on the uh, spike system so now we just did it in the SAM system as well and uh, it's a really great mod the the, um, the quality of the mod and the work that went into it and the installation actually was was really easy to do so I highly recommend the mod it's really cool and basically now what we're going to do is go into the back box and start installing it and we're gonna go through the steps on the process of installing that mod thanks Okay, so we're here now to do an install of Kimball's pinballs in a Sam Stern pinball machine. And basically what you need to do is take your fluorescent bulb out, take out the starter that goes on that side, and then the two uh, white brackets, I guess, or holders for the fluorescent bulb also need to be unscrewed from this screw here. And then the holders after that get placed behind here so they don't get in the way of when you put the uh, the LED uh, foam core back box thing in here. Uh, so then the studs that come with the kit will come off of the screws holes of where you take these out and then they'll come out. We'll get to that next after uh, we remove these two sockets. So now what we're going to do next after taking the fluorescent bulb holders out is the studs that come with the kit to where the uh, foam core type backing goes on to, uh, you would use the hole of where you took your uh, holder out of for your fluorescent bulb, and that's where these screw into. So basically, I tighten this side in, and now you would do the same thing with the other side. And then you would apply your washer on the inside. And then next what you're going to do is take the actual LED back box piece and put it over these two studs that pop out and then apply that box with these wing nuts to uh, hold it down. Okay, so this is the back side of the actual uh, back box with the LEDs and a cable comes with the kit that looks like this with two like speaker wires attached to it. So what you need to do is with this connector right here take this wire with the female side and the two male pins that go in there and plug that in like that. So now what we're going to do is take this and put it into the back box over our studs that we applied in the uh, last uh, part of the video. Okay, so now we applied our LED uh, back box back into the back box of the pinball machine and basically now we just put our wing nuts on and this wire here, as we showed before, that attaches to the back of the mod here, goes, I believe, to your front on the right-hand side of the cabinet is where you get your power for, for this. And basically, there's a splitter that is like that. And basically, if you want to attach more things to your machine, you know, you plug one side into the power source in the machine, and then the other side, it gives you another, you know, like outlet, we'll call it, or another... Um, plug to to include another mod if you need be down the road like a colored DMD or some other kind of mod uh, for your machine. So next we're going to uh, go under the play field and see how this attaches to get power to your mod. Okay so now we're under the play field and basically the power for that mod basically gets hooked into your harness over here. I believe this is your 12 volts that come out of here and that harness that comes from that uh, the LEDs and that uh, mod get connected here so they just get you know connected into all the other mods that you have in your machine or your color DMD and all that kind of stuff so you just power it up over here and it's really it so it's a, to me it's a lot easier actually than the uh, spike system you have one line that really powers everything up and it just connects into your harness uh, part right over here so that's really it. And next, we'll just do a quick video of the mod with the power turned on.